Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Uh, Brian here for another uh, pickup video. Uh, this is a, more of a thrifting video. I will have another video for uh, new release Tuesday and Amazon Prime Day. Uh, so I'm going to dive right on in here. So first thing here is one pickup from Goodwill. So I was in a different area on, what day was it? Sunday? No, Wednesday, sorry, Wednesday morning. Um, they had a lot in there, but a lot of it was just common stuff. So the only thing I picked up was uh, one DVD. It was $1.29, so I picked up uh, Easy Money with Rodney Dangerfield. Uh, I know there's a Blu-ray of this with a double feature with, I think, Men at Work, and it's out of print, so I just picked this up. Uh... Of course, you got Roddy Dangerfield, Joe Pesci, Jennifer Jason Lee, and I think um, Jeffrey Jones is in here as well. I think I see him on the back here. Uh, this is from 1983. It's, it's uh, 95 minutes. Uh, I think I've seen this before, but it's been such a long time. So uh, it's on a flipper. It's on one of those flipper discs. Uh, it's not in the it's not in the best shape, but it's all right. Uh, one side was better than the other. I think the widescreen's fine, but the full screen wasn't, which is fine. I like I prefer widescreen anyway, but there's the, the spine there. So, easy money. Uh, I went to uh, one of my local bookstores. Not really local, it's a different area, but uh, one of the my favorite bookstores. i uh, been going there since I was a child, so... Uh, not a lot going on in there either, but I did end up picking up, uh, $3 DVDs and then one, I guess, regular, I guess not really regular price, and then one book. So the book I got was one of these weird, like, you read part of it and then you have to flip it over and read the other side. So this is Ghost Rider, Steer Clear of Haunted Hill. So there's, um, there's two different, I guess, uh, from two, two points of view, I guess. Uh, yeah, so you get Alex's version and then you get Gabby's version. So I, I liked, I enjoyed the show, so I figured I'd pick this up too. Um, this is coming to Blu-ray, I think, in the next couple of months. So I wanted to watch some of it before I did. Uh, this is only, I think, a few ep a few episodes. Maybe not. It's only 45 minutes. This is uh, Ghost Stories. Um, a Paranormal Insight. Have you ever felt a chill? So I figured I'd pick this up and give it a watch. Uh... Is printed in Canada, made in USA. So I've never seen this show before, but it is coming to Blu-ray here soon. So I picked that up. Um, the next three are all we're all a dollar a piece. So I know this has a Blu-ray or 4K from Vinegar Syndrome, but I didn't pick it up. This has something that Cynthia Rothrock and Bolo Young in it, and this is Tiger Claws 2. Got it for 99 cents. It's one of those old like jewel case cases. Where it just opens up and you get the disc. It's the same artwork in behind this, and then you get all the other, um, I guess, releases that they had. They had another one like this, but the disc was not in really good shape, so I had to pass on it. I forget what which title it was though. It's not on the back here, so we got Tiger Claws Two. Uh, I've seen this uh, a couple places, but the disc has always been terrible. But this one was pretty good. It says Danny Aiello in it, and it's called Dead Silence. Um, so it's like a revenge thriller, more than a horror. It's, it's kind of horror-esque with the cover, but it's more of a thriller. Uh, as far as other cast members go, I don't really recognize anyone else. Uh, I don't know what year this is from. I think it's from 2001. Yeah, it looks like 2001, and then this DVD was released in 2006. And then I was surprised to find this for a dollar. This is a complete series uh, put out by Shot Factory uh, with Dennis Leary. It's called The Job. 
the discs were fine. I don't know why it was marked down to a dollar, but I grabbed it. Uh, you get one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Uh, Nineteen episodes on four discs. So let me know if you've seen this. I've never. I don't remember this. This is from uh, I think it's two thousand and one, two thousand two. All right, so one more thrift store, and that was um, Hope's Treasures, like a local uh, thrift store. There's a couple locations in the area. I got uh, five DVDs and five Blu-rays. Uh, four Blu-rays are actually one series, so start with the DVDs first. We have, this is like a, kind of like a new release within the last year, I believe. Uh, Above Suspicion here with uh, Amelia Clark, Johnny Knoxville, and Jack Houston, Huston. Thor Birch is also in this. Um, I've heard mixed reviews on this, but I figured I'd pick it up for like two, I think it was two dollars, so check that out. Um, got a Warner Brothers release here of uh, Just just Cause with Sean Connery and Lawrence Fishburne. Uh, Ed Harris is also in this. This is from 1995. This is a thriller. It says it's the best thriller since Silence of the Lambs, but you know, I don't know. Good cast though. Uh, yeah, nothing special on the disc there. Uh, got a Warner Archive here with Andy Griffith called A Deadly Game. This is from 1977. It's kind of weird though. It's it's in it's, it, it looks like it's in black and white. It's actually in color. So it's very weird. Um, decent cast in here though. You got uh, James Crow Cromwell, Morgan Woodward, Dan O. Hurley, Claude Earl Jones. I don't know if this is related to James Earl Jones. Um, Sharon Spellman and Hunter Von Leer. 90 minutes long. I think this is a uh, mystery political thriller. Oh, this is this is this is a second movie in a series apparently. This is uh Andy Griffith is back as Abel Marsh in a second telefilm about dark doings in the quirky mountain village of Jasper Lake. I don't know. But you know, it's your typical, you know, burn on demand, uh, you know, Warner Archive disc. I actually found two Kino Lorber titles there too, which was, which blew me away. Nothing, you know, special I guess but this one here is James Kahn I know she, he recently passed this is a uh, journey to Shiloh I think this is like a western looks like a western to me uh, Don Stroud is also in this from 1968 101 minutes and then this one looks like it's a action Oh, this is a sequel. Yeah, of course it is. Wild Geese 2 with uh, Scott Glenn, Barbara Carrera, Edward Fox, Lawrence Oliver. Decent cast there. It's from 1985, 125 minutes. And then for Blu-rays here, I got, I believe this is the whole series. Um, I don't know if I'll ever watch it though. It's animated. It's called The Legend of Korra. You know, got all four volumes here on Blu-ray. Put up by Nickelodeon and Paramount. They're all two disc sets, so a total of uh, eight discs there. And then this one was interesting. I've heard of this film, but I've never actually seen it. It's got uh, Tom Hanks in it, Paul Newman, Jude Law, Jennifer Jason Lee. I like I like her a lot, so that's why I picked it up. Daniel Craig, Stanley Tucci. So awesome cast here. This is uh, 
road to uh what did I say that per Dition, road to Perdition uh, from 2002, put out by Paramount, still factory sealed. So, I don't know if you've seen this, I don't think I've ever, I've heard of it, but I never actually got around to watching it. So, all right, guys, and then I'm gonna go ahead and add my two Dollar General pickups here as well, just to make this move this video a little bit longer. Uh, Went to one of my local, not my local, uh, one of the, I guess, local to over there, uh, Dollar Generals. They got a new shipper in there. Unfortunately, it was all DVDs except for a couple Blu-rays. Um, they had Jurassic World in there, but I already have it. So I ended up leaving with two titles. Well, technically five titles. Uh, we got a barbed wire here with Pam Anderson. Steve Rowles back in Udo Kier from 1996. I remember when this came out, but I never watched it. So I'm sure it's not the greatest movie in the world. And then we have this um, four pack. Um, I, it's not a high, it's, it's, it's not a steel book. It's just a hard, hard uh, case of uh, four musical collection here from Warner Brothers. We got the bandwagon Calamity Jane, Kiss Me Kate, and Singing in the Rain on Blu-ray. So I thought that was a cool deal for $7. So that's everything for this video, but stay tuned. I will be having another video shortly after this one. So let me know if you've seen any of these and what you thought of them in the comments below. And I'll catch you guys shortly. Bye.